Right, what is going on everybody, it's back with another video. And in today's video guys, we're doing another viewer suggested build, and this one is from SRVC Victory again, which I realized I did yours last time, and I'm sorry, I didn't notice that I picked your comment again until I finished this build, so. Anyway, I'm showcasing your build today, and you asked, you should build a house that is snow themed or a nether theme. So I took that idea, and I made it both. So I made not only a nether theme, but also a snow themed house. So this is, it's basically snow, and it's got nether brick scattered throughout as we do our 360 panorama around the entire build. This is the entire thing. And let's get down into it and get inside. Okay, so the coolest thing about this house is that we can actually control it using snow blocks. So if we look about right here, jump and throw a snowball, as you can see, we'll fall down into this hatch and then we can enter. And that's the enter into the house. That's the only way to get in. And uh, that's how you get into the house. And this is, we're now inside. And as you can see, it's made out of nether brick, ice, and snow. Okay, so as we enter the house, uh, you know, it seems pretty basic in here, but once again, it's controlled by Snowball, so to turn on the lights, we just hit the light switch up there. That turns our lights on. Come over here, we got a little TV, and if we actually place a top, some top snow right there, as you can see, a crafting table and a chest will come up out of the floor. And if we search this chest, we can find this bow, which is our light switch. As you can see, only two of the lights turned on, so we have a third one over here that we have to Kobe. Kobe, Kobe for Kobe. There we go. Put that back, and we can just hide those away just like that, and everything's back to normal there. As you can see, we have all three lights on, and it's lit up in here now. Right over here, we have a snowball giver. This will just give you a snowball if you step over it, just to help me refill. I'll get back 16. All right, and then, let's see. We can throw something right there. As you can see, that'll open up into the basement, and down here is the bedroom. And to turn on these lights, you just simply have to update that block, and there you go. You've got lights. And you can do that and shut that. And that, it's just, that's all there is down here, just a bed and a chest. It's its pretty simple. And we can close that up just by placing another piece of snow right there. Uh, if we come over here, as you can see, we uh, place some snow right there. And up will come snow columns. And also a chest came out of the ground over here. Now what this does is this is our snow golem machine. So as you can see, now we can make snow golems out of those snow blocks that just rose up. And we can put some put the extra stone back in the chest and we can close this area up so now that chest will go away and over here we have the kitchen area so this house likes snow so if you feed it snow like this it'll return food in your favor as you can see we just got pumpkin pie you can sit here and you can keep giving it snow and it'll keep feeding you food as you can see we now have carrots cookies and pumpkin pie and we can store it in this chest down here and that's the kitchen area this end chest is just vibing that's just there for decorations and that's pretty much it for redstone builds. That's all I got inside this house. I didn't fit a whole bunch of redstone. I kind of just went for more of the design. As you can see, it feels very isolated in here. We're very locked up in here with these iron bars and the ice and the snow, I think, look decent. So once again, we'll walk back out here. And we got the nether brick design with the ice. And it, it looks pretty clean, I think. But the coolest thing about this house is it actually has a defense mechanism. So if we go back down here and, oh, look out, snow goal. We throw our, throw our snow over there and we drop back down. If we actually place a piece of snow right there, what that's going to do is that's going to activate the defense mechanism. And as you can see, there are now snowballs launching up from the side of the house. And this will go on for a long time. The house, this is its defense mechanism. It launches outside the gates. If anything tries to get inside, it will get hit by a snowball. And this, this is kind of satisfying to watch, but it will go on for a while. I'll go, we'll go into creative quick to get a look at this. This is what it looks like in creative. As you can see, it's firing from all cylinders, all sides of the house are protected by the snowballs. It's a cool defense mechanism. I just thought it was a cool idea, so I threw it in. But once again, thanks for the suggestion. This was a pretty fun build. I think it turned out pretty decent. And yeah, thank you all so much. Keep suggesting things. This was a fun house to build, and it's, it's satisfying to watch the snowballs get launched up into the air. Nothing's getting in there. Absolutely nothing. Well, anyways, guys, it's been Spinny. Thank you all for watching. Leave more suggestions in the comments, please. Thank you all so much. Peace out.